In many diagnostic scenarios, clinicians must determine if the patient is fluid responsive. The key issue is whether stroke volume will increase with a fluid bolus. Why is this important? Because approximately 50% of ICU patients are fluid responsive. For the other 50%, increased fluid is associated with increased morbidity and or mortality. With Cheetah Medical's Starling SV, you can monitor hemodynamic parameters non-invasively. Since the fluid challenge can be achieved with a simple passive leg raise, care can be initiated and driven by the nurse. The Starling SV provides continuous, accurate, non-invasive hemodynamic monitoring and empowers fluid management in virtually any clinical setting. It utilizes bioreactants, a technology that was developed by Cheetah medical scientists over years of research and development. This was then followed by extensive testing and validation. The basis behind the Starling SV is the use of time delay or phase shifts, which occur when an alternating electrical current is passed through the thorax. The Starling SV has eight sensors on four sensor pads. Four outer sensors emit a low level electrical current and four inner sensors detect the information and send it back to the monitor. As the heart expands and contracts, a time delay or phase shift is created in the current by blood flow. The monitor then uses this phase shift as a baseline for measurement. To determine fluid responsiveness or volume status, a fluid bolus is delivered. If the heart can receive more fluid, we'll see greater outflow and a longer time delay, equivalent to the increase in stroke volume. If the stroke volume increase is greater than 10%, then the patient is determined to be fluid responsive. This is also represented on the Starling SV monitor by the estimated location of the indicator on the Starling curve. Its location will appear on the steep ascending portion. If it's less than 10%, the patient is considered not to be fluid responsive. The indicator will be approximately close to or on the top part of the Starling curve. Although the technology is highly sophisticated, the Starling SV is easy to use. Additionally, its 100% non-invasive nature allows for hospital-wide implementation in multiple sites of care. The Starling SV provides a conclusive answer to the key question, is my patient fluid responsive? Enhancing your ability to make informed, potentially life-saving decisions in high-stress patient scenarios.